When working with documents, sometimes you want to have information on every page, such as the page number or other information inside a header, something found at the top of the document, or a footer, something found at the bottom of the document on every page. We're going to go ahead and add a header and a footer to this document. To do that, click on the Insert tab, go over to the Header and Footer section, click on Header, and it gives you predefined layouts for what you want to do. You can scroll down and see the different header designs that they have created. What I want to do is just choose, actually I'm going to choose the first one right here, blank text. I like to type in my own text. You will see this dotted line here and a tab saying this is a header. This is indicating this is separate from your document and your document text is now grayed out. That's because while you're in the header mode, you cannot change or edit your, your content for your, par your page. So this header, I'm going to go ahead and put the title of this document. I click inside and I'm going to call it Ipsum text. Now when I click up here it says close. This First of all this shows me all the different options of things I can put inside of my header. I'm going to close the header. That's just what I want. I just want the title of the document on there and I can scroll down and I can see it's on the next page as well. Now I want to put a footer on here as well. I do the same thing. I go to insert footer and I'm going to choose just a blank one again. Now with this one, instead of typing in something, I want it to say what page number I'm on. I can simply click up here. When I'm selected inside the header or in the footer, a new tab appears. This is the design tab for header and footer. I can come over here to page number and it asks me where I want to insert the page number and I'm going to choose current position and it just puts it in right there. Now I can scroll down and it's automatically placed inside of page 2 and on each page. So this is a way you can add a header or a footer to your document. When you're working with headers and footers, the design tab pops up and it gives you a couple of extra options. You can insert things such as the date and time and it gives you options of how you want that to be viewed. You can see it puts it in. You can insert in quick parts and it gives you a couple of things here you can do. You can insert in pictures, clip art. You can also switch between the header and the footer simply by clicking on go to header or go to footer. You can also go between sections simply by clicking on next section or previous section. So these are some things you can do to add a header or a footer to your document. You can change the amount of space it takes up over here by using the position. This will make a larger header and you can see that space is getting larger or you can make it smaller simply by clicking or you can put in whatever value you want. So this is how to add headers and footers to your document.